Hi, this is uh, just a little add-on video for Linear Theory Lesson 10, just in case you're interested in melodic inversions. We're not really doing this as part of your assignment for the class, but I thought there might be a few of you that would be interested in seeing it. So I just want to show you real quick. A melodic inversion is really when you just take a melody and you flip it over. Let me just show you real quickly here. On a melodic inversion, I, I wrote the melody Twinkle Twinkle Little Star here. Da 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 Basically a melodic inversion is when you start on the same note and rather than going up the interval that goes, we're going to go the opposite direction. So we would find that interval and we would say, okay, that's a fifth. So rather than going up a fifth, we're going to go down a fifth. So the next two notes would be a fifth below the G or two C's. Okay, now here we go up a second. So instead of going up a second from here, we're going to go down a second. So we're going to have two Bs. Then it goes down a second, so we're going to go back up a second to the C. Then we keep going down by seconds here, so we're going to go up a second, up a second, up a second, and lo and behold, we're going to end at the same note. We're going to end on the tonic note again. This would be what we know as a tonal melodic inversion. A strict melodic inversion, that's a little hard to read, S-T-R-I-C-T. -T. A strict melodic inversion would be when I take a look and I go, okay, that's a perfect fifth up, so I want to go a perfect fifth down. That's a major second up, so I want to go a major second down. That would make that a B flat. Um, and so on. Typically, tonal inversion is the one that we use the most often, but we certainly can use strict inversion too. This is a little bit different than the intervallic inversion that we are really doing for this lesson, but I thought some of you might like to understand it a little bit more. This will not show up on your final. This is strictly for your information. Okay, hope it helps, and you might want to use this as you're maybe trying to write some music or do some stuff that's creative on your own. Take care.